All right, let's continue. Yay! <laughs> so lightning bolts, uh, apparently. Yeah, that is another shard, but you know. He's gonna shout it right in front of you because that's cool, right? That's what all the villains do. This guy is fucking built. And looks kinda weird, but okay. Of course, it actually does give you a choice here, but I assume if you choose uh, the shard, then uh, you won't be able to get Jambio. And uh, yeah, he will just kill him. Uh, but the right choice, right in commas, is to ch choose Jambio. Once again, the first option. He is still going to destroy the magic crystal, but. But no. You, you should probably just take him because I believe you won't be able to get his uh, item. Yep. And yeah, it's gone. What a stereotypical villain. Well, we got another. We got another summon. I've not even shown any of them. Alright, so... Yeah. This is the Desert Dwellers Camp, by the way. It's got kind of strange music. Uh, right, but well, there's no reason we should stay here. Uh, we need to go to uh, Jambia's place, which is the jungle up the very north here. Here it is. So, yeah. Here's the jungle. Welcome to the jungle. Yes, yeah, so logs. Oh, oops. Uh, right, okay. Enemies. I don't really care here. I got min. I don't really need those. I don't need light either. Right, okay, um. Well, let's get uh, a in here. Apparently, Jambi is the uh, the least expensive. So as the tune was before, but maybe not. That's damage. All right, let's get the big guy in the back there. I don't even know what he looks like. It's very strange. But yeah, we'll get a couple fights going where I'm, uh, where I use these summons here, <clears throat> or maybe just this one. Nice. <laughs> I need to get my bearings around this area first. I actually got really stuck here the last the last time I was playing from something incredibly stupid. Now, I believe I want to go up, right, and then we need to find our log, yes, right, so we want to go in this cave, and then uh, this little bit in here will take you to a save point, it's not like you really need it, but, you know, if you need it, then you just go in there and uh, save up and heal up. Alright, so the part I got really stuck on was um, the part coming up, which uh, you get the chest here, and then you go into this area, 
Uh, I didn't talk to Jambia when I went into this area. Basically, when you go into this area, he goes over there and he just sits there. Uh, now, I'll get this thing here, which is the brown scarf. So we have like five of them at this point, something like that. Now make sure you talk to Jambia because he'll tell you what what to do here. <laughs> so basically it is a uh, substitute. Southwest. So make sure you talk to him because last time I did not talk to him, went to that tree and nothing happened. So yeah, <laughs> I was sitting there for ages. Right. Um, why am I trying to go in here? This tree. And um, there we go. I think that's all you need to do, actually. Now, wait, give me a sec here. I believe there's also a treasure chest somewhere around here. Oh, really? Oh, okay, it was open already for some reason. My bad. Uh, suspenders. What the hell are those? Oh, it's for Ifra, is it? Ifra only. Uh, put those on. Right. Now we want to go back where we were before, if I'm correct. <laughs> uh, I believe you go down here. Yes. Save the hair, yeah. <laughs> Amazing. Doing some weird movements there. Right. Okay, it does that automatically. Hey, Jabia. When did you get there? So yeah, this is the way you get the earth spells back. Flying rock. <laughs> Destruct orb. Okay. Alright, so once again we have a few more spells for Ifrit that I'm probably not going to use that much, but oh well. Alright, so... Now we do the next part, which is the camp we were just in. The, the desert camp. Alright, fly all the way south, <laughs> oh, it was somewhere over here, right? Yes. And in we go. Alright, so next thing we want to do is... Right, I can't do anything while I've got this. Right, okay. We talked to this guy in the middle. This guy's name's Quatar, or something like that. Take the test. Yes. So, shoot Ren's go do something. Uh, so yeah, I believe Shukran basically does this next part by herself. There's not really too much to do in here by herself, but you know. Of course she will get attacked. And we go then. 
So is it just me? Yes, it's just me. Right, so I turned on encounters. So I'll probably get into a couple fights. Um, weird enemies. <laughs> I don't know. Can I take these guys? They're probably a little... Uh, yeah, they're, they're really weak in here, to be honest. Dark 5. Hmm. So, I can... Let's just keep going down or something. I think that's the wrong way, but oh well. Uh, I got two... Two fives there. Yeah, these guys are pretty bad. <laughs> Air 5, I think I have that as well. Right, I don't know which way I'm going. Hey, an R enemy. Air 5, do I already have that? Yes, I do. I also have two level 2s. Harpy. I don't really need more than one, so yeah. And then, uh. Oh, I can't put down another one. Okay. Doop. Alright. <laughs> Crackles all over here. More useless cards that I'm just gonna ditch. And then, uh, we get to the top of this place. And immediately get attacked. Um, this guy seems pretty big. <laughs> God. Recover HP. Let's do this. Shouldn't be too hard, honestly. I probably should have got a summon in here, though. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, you're meant to lose this fight, obviously. Like, my summon would actually help. Meanwhile, yep, we got these two. Tooth. Why do you have the structure anyway? And then immediately gives it to Ifrit. Return the water crystal. Uh, I believe you saw it yes here, but he won't take it anyway. Yeah, he did. He did. He does ask for something though. Goddess of the Oasis. Icicle Whirlwind Slice. Alright. And immediately after, you find yourself back here. Right, so we just go to the Oasis next, apparently. And uh, you can actually get something out of here. You get a cute outfit, apparently. Right, so I'm going to be right back. And uh, yeah, we'll get to the last part of this section. Alright, so I went to the Oasis, and immediately this happens. Gets attacked, but you know, isn't this guy incredibly easy? Wasn't this one of the first guys we fought? Maybe he's up a little bit. Yeah, he's up a lot. But he still goes down in one round anyway, so whatever. And we can go talk to this guy. Okay, man. Uh, right, uh, where do we need to go? Right, there is a huge pond here, but uh, yeah, right here. <laughs> Me. 
Mish Mish, apparently. I just don't know. Dupe. Well, someone died. Amazing, surely. Ah, uh, right, so I believe I talked to her again. And brings out the tune apparently. Okay. After this, we got to go to our mountain, which is great. And once again, we've got like another summon in like the span of like half an hour. <laughs> there you go. Okay. And we're just chilling. Desert Rose, Mount Dubaya, Badaya even. Huh. Alright, yes, okay, she, she gives you her scarf as well, which is good. You, <laughs> you don't need to go searching for it or anything. Uh, but yeah, that should about do it for this section, so uh, I'll see you guys next time on Arabian Nights, Desert Spirit King. <laughs>